One of the newer advents in mountain biking technology or trends that's caught on over the past few years are these rubberized chain stay protectors that not only protect the paint in the metal or carbon, but they quiet the bike down. But not every bike has them. Whether you're rocking an older bike that didn't come equipped with one or maybe something like this aluminum gravel bike, it's good to have anyway. It protects your paint and it keeps your bike quiet. And who doesn't like a quiet bike? But don't fear if your bike didn't come with one or if it doesn't have one, we can make our own, just like we've already been doing for years. You'll need some Scotch 2228 rubberized tape, otherwise known as mastic tape, a pair of scissors, and an old bike tube. So basically we're using the age old trick of wrapping a tube around your chainstay for protection, but we're adding some more noise damping material and making it a little bit more modern. So start by shifting your gears into a lower gear, and that'll give you a little bit more chain clearance to work with. Then you can measure out a piece of this mastic tape according to your chainstay length. It's also a good idea to look directly over your chain stay and see where it meets your chain. And that way you have a better idea of where you can wrap the mastic tape around to fully protect everything. So once you have your piece of tape off the backing, you can apply it to the chain stay. Make sure you stretch and kind of conform and apply this tape around the chain stay. That way it bonds better, it fits better to the bike over time and it won't move. Next, we're gonna cut off three small pieces. For my bike, I need these maybe a little bit over an inch, maybe an inch and a quarter each. And then we're gonna take those smaller pieces and we're gonna put them on the other piece of long massive tape stretched all the way across the chain stay. So basically we're just adding three, four, five, however many you decide little ridges across the longer piece of mastic tape. And since the tape on tape thing looks kind of janky, we're just going to clean up the exterior look with an old inner tube. I use an older one from a road or gravel bike. I think the less material you can get away with on this part, the better because it's going to keep the overall profile of the chain stay a little bit more narrow. I also cut the tube straight down the middle and that way I'm not double wrapping it with the whole tube. I can just flatten out the whole thing and then it's a single layer going around the whole chain stay. And just like you'd wrap any old chain stay with uh, an old bicycle tube, uh, same goes for here. You want to tuck the first part under and then wrap around and it should catch in place. Keep tension on the tube, keep it nice and tight, that way it lays more flat. and then just tension and pull the whole thing around the chain stay. Tension and pull, tension and pull. So the whole thing should stay in place all the way till the end of your tube wrap, and then we're gonna finish it off with some electrical tape. Same thing goes for the electrical tape. Tension and pull, tension and pull. If it creases in any spot, just pull it right out, make sure it lays nice and flat, and that way it's looking good. And for an added bonus here, an extra security, you can just wrap a little zip tie around the electrical tape, and that's going to make sure it stays right where it needs to be. And once that's on, you can kind of see that you've got a little bit more cushion, a little bit more rubber to soak up any noise from metal to metal contact. You can give the old drop test again and make sure you've got the chain stay protector, the noise damper, exactly where you like. Should sound much better than before without any of the loud tings or tangs. So there you have it, a more modern DIY chain slap protector and noise damper to keep up with the trends. I hope you enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to our YouTube channel if you want more. Drop any DIY comments on this problem, noisy chain slap, if you have any in the comments section. Check out singletracks.com for more mountain bike news. Thanks, we'll see you later.